Hi students, I am Priyanka Jain and I am a verified educator at the Unacademy Plus platform. You can watch several of my plus classes. Okay, I have soon started a catalyst batch course for the whole inorganic chemistry. You will see all the inorganic chemistry in this course and this is for the upcoming June 2022 exam of the CSIR net as well as for the GET exam, okay? So if you want to see different of the my lectures, different courses, you can see on the Unacademy. Take the subscription of the Unacademy. And if you want to see the free classes, there are also several free classes. Every month I take several free classes. You can watch these free classes without taking subscription. So for this, you will have to uncode my code. My code is Priyanka Jain 10. By clicking on this code, you will get the link for my classes. Thank you. Hi students, welcome in chemistry classes. I am Priyanka Jain and you are watching the questions from CSIRnet 2022 question paper. The question paper is from February 2022. Okay. See here, one question is asked on the reaction cross section. Okay. So this question is basically the reaction cross section is expected to be largest for the reaction. Which reaction will have the largest reaction cross section? Okay. So for this, one thing that you should know is about the harpoon mechanism. Okay. This question is based on the harpoon mechanism. According to harpoon mechanism, the formula is E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught R is equal to ionization energy minus electron affinity. Okay. Here in this whole formula, this thing E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught, this whole thing is constant. Okay. This will be a constant. Okay. So this will not change. Okay. So what we can write that 1 upon R is inversely proportional to IE minus EA. It means it is inversely proportional to this energy change. Okay. Here what is this R? This is actually the reaction cross section. Okay. This is the reaction cross section and that is inversely proportional to this value of delta E. It means larger this value, lower will be the reaction cross section and if this value is smaller, then this reaction cross section will be largest. Okay. So, for the R to be largest, for R to be largest, this value delta E should be smallest. Okay. And this value is depending upon the two things. One is the ionization energy and one is the electron affinity. It means when this ionization energy is smaller, when this is smaller and this is larger, then this value will be smaller. Okay. When this is smaller and this is larger, then we are getting a little del E value. This will be smallest in this case. Okay. So, we have to find out this thing. Okay. In the four options, we have to find out one in which the ionization energy is the smallest and the electron affinity is largest. Okay. So, see here. Electron affinity means the affinity for the electrons. The energy that is related with the taking of electrons. When we are gaining electron, when this atom is gaining electron, how much energy is released? That is called electron affinity. Okay. So, here we have given chlorine. Okay. In all the cases we have given chlorine. So, chlorine will have the same electron affinity. Now, we have given here lithium, here sodium, here potassium and here rubidium. Okay. And in this case we have to concern the ionization energy. Okay. So, ionization energy as you know, as you go down the group, as you are going down the group, the ionization energy will decrease. Okay. As you are going down the group, the ionization energy is decreasing. Why? Because the size of the atom is increasing while the distance from the nucleus is increasing. So, the atom will have a little affinity for the electron. So, the electron can be easily pulled out. Okay. So, a little amount of energy is required to pull out an electron. Okay. So, ionization energy will decrease as you are going down the group. So, this lithium will have the highest ionization energy and this rubidium will have the smallest ionization energy. So, electron affinity is same for all, but ionization energy is lowest for rubidium. It means this will be the case. 
in the case of rubidium this ionization energy is smallest so the reaction cross section will be largest it means our option number 4 is the right answer okay so in this way you have to do the question question is basically simple one one time more this type of question has been asked in the csir net exam okay so you can see that question also otherwise i will give you that question also in my one of the video okay so i think you will like this video and if you are liking this please share please subscribe and please comment us thank you